Hello and welcome to Mock Productions. You are here with me, Matthew, and we are back here with the Advent Calendar. So, we are now on to day 20. Can't believe we're on day 20. It's just flying by. But let's see what's behind day 20. So, behind day 20 is going to be another one of the Lucky Dip slash mystery boxes for the Wave 3 figures. Um, so we're just going to go into the box again, pull out another one, and see which one we get. But we've already had two awesome ones so far. If you haven't seen them, go check out the other days. Go on, go over. Go over before you see these. Um, but, yeah, let's let's just check out and see what's going on. Okay, so we are here with the third uh, mystery unboxing here of what will come out of this box. You know, it's a mystery as to which character we can actually pull out of this box. So without further ado, let's go in and uh, pick out the next character, which is gonna be, if I can get the tag. Ooh. Come here, come here. I got you, I got you. Which one we got? Ooh, very nice indeed. Look at who we have here. We have Pitpos. Um, wow, this guy looks amazing. Almost taking up the whole entire box. They're very much pushed to the back. Um, wow, this guy is really long as well with the staff coming out really far. That is looking really, really cool actually. Uh, there's that. There he is in game there. He's got his tongue out. There you go. You can see him there, Master Pit Boss. Obviously, another of the sorcerers. But wow, is this guy so, so cool. That is really, really awesome. Let's get this guy out because I really want to see <clears throat> what he is actually like. Because he looks really, really long. especially And dropping the knife would really help. Um, but he looks really, really long as well. So that's really cool. Um, let's get a more up-close look at this guy. Oh boy. Yes, look at this. So I'm pull him out of his face. Twist him out here. Ugh, the squeak is real. There we go. Um, wow. Oh my gosh, this guy is so, so cool. Wow, let's put all the packaging off to the side. Let's come in for a bit more of a HD look at this dude here. Bringing that down a little bit more. Wow, look at this. This is amazing. So number one, first thing, this part is slightly wiggly wiggly. Sort of like a, uh, a string sort of cloth section coming off the hood there. But wow, look at the detail there, the snake skin. The paint is amazing there, the eyes look really, really evil. Uh, this thing keeps poking the camera every now and again. But look at this, I mean, that there's like that, an orb or some sort of gem in there. But it comes all the way back along here. This massive sort of staff here, and it really is something massive. It comes off the base, I mean, look, that you know, it's really long. That's crazy. Really, really crazy there. Loving these uh, the gauntlets here with all these sort of like bolt things. Um, wow, well, this is just crazy. But the actual snake body itself seems to be hidden underneath this robe. But well, the robe is just fantastic, very Egyptian-like. Um, but I'm just loving the look of this guy. He looks really, really cool. Um, really nice indeed. Fantastic stuff. Um, another new undead sorcerer there. But let's just have some comparisons between him. Uh, we'll go with Kingpen. So Kingpen is still the highest. Let me just bring this a little bit up and then move them a little bit back. That's better. Uh, so Kingpen is definitely still highest, but in terms of width now, this is probably one of the longest characters that way. The staff really does push him out quite far, um, but Wow, what a, you know, what an awesome looking character, really, really is. Another one, let's go with Dr. Neo Cortex again. Very, very cool stuff. Uh, then let's go with another one of the Wave 3s, uh, Boom Bloom. There they both are, looking very, very cool. And then let's bring in another one of our unboxed Wave 3s. We have the Buckshot. Very nice indeed, looking very, very cool. A lot of them seem to be uh, looking over this direction, um, except this guy, of course. We have Flare Wolf. Flare Wolf looks absolutely amazing. He really, really does look so, so cool. So awesome, a nice bulky figure there. But we're not on about Flare Wolf, we're on about Pit Boss here. And Pit Boss is just looking extremely cool. Can't wait to get some gameplay out of all of these guys. But look, we have quite a few of the Wave 3s now. And they are looking to be a pretty good set. 
Very, um, they're all very different, you know, I mean, okay, all Skylanders are different, but they are literally all different. They are, like, crazy. Um, but a lot of animal-based ones here, you've got a buck, uh, you've got a wolf, you've got a snake, and then you've got a plant, or a turnip. Let's just give her the name Turnip. Um, but yeah, rather cool indeed, very, very awesome stuff. Um, crazy, crazy stuff. But Pit Boss is definitely a very, very cool figure. Looks to be pretty interesting, and I can't wait to actually uh, use him in hand and check out all of his skills and abilities and everything like that. Um, start upgrading and everything like that. It's going to be so, so awesome. But um, yeah, that will do for this advent calendar video, so make sure to hit that subscribe button below if you're new to the channel, and uh, check out all the advent calendar videos throughout the uh, month of December. We've only got a few left, so make sure to stay tuned for the rest, because some are going to be amazing. Uh, but other than that, I'll leave it here, so thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.